What I'm going to show you today is how to change a preset in a MIDI-enabled device using the command centre. You might need this to change the sound on an amp, change the preset on an effects pedal or keyboard or drum machine, whatever. I'm going to be changing presets on my old GR20 guitar synth, but the principle is the same for whatever device you're using. The MIDI cable connection itself is very straightforward. There is one MIDI output on the HX or Helix, and there will be one MIDI input on the second device. Connect these two together using a standard 5-pin MIDI cable. You will need to know which MIDI channel the second device is set to. On the GR20 it's a simple matter of pressing the System Edit button until MIDI CH is highlighted. And you can see that mine is set to channel 1. To correct the MIDI instruction, first select your preset. Now you can do this procedure from either the Select Preset screen or from within the preset itself. Now press the Settings button and choose Command Center. Along the bottom you can see we have six icons for instant commands, six for foot switches, more if you have a helix, and two for expression pedals. These allow you to send a MIDI instruction either when you select the preset itself, the instant commands, or when you use a foot switch, the foot switches, or expression pedal within the preset. I'm just going to demonstrate the first two because not everyone watching this will have an expression pedal and the principle is exactly the same as using foot switches anyway. So having selected my preset, here's how to create an instant switch. Note that the Helix MIDI values start at 0 whereas the GR20s start at 1. So if I want preset 10 on the GR20 I have to use a value of 9 in the HX. This should all become clear. So, procedure as before, settings command center and if I want to select between the different switches I can either press each switch and it will scroll through them same with the foot switches or you can use the big knob to scroll through every single one so if I go with instant switch 1 you can see it gives you instant 1 there switch between them the command I want is appearing on foot switch 2 so I need to change this to Bank PC, or Bank Program Change. So the values for the Bank Program Change options are the MIDI channel. Now obviously we've already discussed that and that's MIDI channel 1 we want. Uh, the second value, CC0, is a Bank Change value, so the Bank MSB in MIDI. If your device doesn't have banks um, or you don't wish to change banks then you can leave that off. I'm going to put it on Bank uh, sorry, wrong button. Uh, bank zero, um, because that's my user defined program bank on the GR20. The other values are another bank option, bank LSB. I don't need that on my device, but um, consult your documentation to see whether you do on yours. And finally, the actual program change you want. So if I want preset two on my GR20, I need to set it to value one as discussed. If your MIDI values coincide on your two devices, then obviously you just set it to the value that you want. That's all you need to do for that. Um, obviously, uh, exit back out and save, save the preset. And now every time you change to that preset, it will send the MIDI values that you've just programmed in. So a program change um, to bank zero, um, value two, or whatever we set it for in the end. Now, to do the foot switch, it's exactly the same method. Foot switch 1. Now, we don't want to use foot switch 1 because that already had an effect on it, so we'll use foot switch 2. There, foot switch 2. Again, change our value there to bank PC, bank program change, MIDI channel to 1, CC value to 0. And if we set our program to this one to 5, so we want preset 6 on the GR20, 
mode exit, save, and now we can see we've got a bank program change button uh, within the preset. Every time you step on that, it will program change over on the GR20. And that's pretty much how you do it.